So I am making a felt mobile for my baby room and doing a cactus theme. Um, so I thought I'd do a little tutorial on how to do it. So I've made these ones so far and I'm going to make one more and show you how to do it. So first you start by making both halves. So the front side and the back side. Um, by cutting it out, I just folded a piece of felt in half and I will draw the, a design on um, with a Sharpie and then cut it out. Okay, this is the design I drew. I'm planning on doing this. You won't see any of these lines right here. Um, kind of like in this, you won't see the lines. Um, and then I will put a flower on this side, I think. Okay, I've cut out the design. Um, just with some fabric scissors. So this side that has the Sharpie on it will go on the inside. Um, and so it'll be like this. So now I'm going to take a half of it and I'm going to sew on lines right here and in here. Um, like you can see I did with this one just to make it um, a little more dynamic. And so I'll do that on the front side, and then I'll also do it on the back side, which would be like this, and I'll try and match the designs. Okay, so now I've sewn both sides of my cactus, and I just did this with a regular sewing machine. Um, it is a little difficult to get the curves. Um, you could definitely probably get better curves if you just hand stitch it. Um, but now I'm going to turn these so the um, wrong sides are facing each other. And I'm going to sew as close to the edge as I can all the way around, um, but not sew the bottom because this is where I will stuff, um, put stuffing in it. Okay, so now that I've sewn around here, you can tell it's not perfect. I'm not a perfectionist, <laughs> but um, anyways. You just wanna make sure that there's no holes. So I had a couple holes like right here on the back where it wasn't together. Um, if you want to, you could pin it and then the, you wouldn't have that issue. But um, I have this stuffing and I'm just gonna put that in here and if to get them into these small areas at the top, I've just been using the end of my Sharpie and um, stuffing it in. Okay, so now that it's stuffed, I'm just going to take this and sew across the bottom. I'll make sure to back stitch on each side and try and include all of these stitches in that so it doesn't come undone. All right, so my little cactus is done and now I'm going to take some um, yellow felt and I'm going to make a little flower like I did for this one. So, so just take a small square of felt, so I'll cut this right here. Um, you could draw on a flower. I did four petal flowers. They seem to work out good. Um, so yeah, just cut four petals. Okay, so here's my four petals cut. Um, doesn't have to be perfect. They're gonna be squished together anyways. Um, but now what you want to do is fold it in half, whichever way you want, kind of, so it kind of looks like a butterfly. And we're just going to sew right along that edge that you folded. Okay, so it should look like this. And then we're going to open it up and we're going to fold it the opposite direction. Sorry, this is hard to do with one hand. Like this, so it's a butterfly the opposite direction and choose where we want it on our cactus. So I'll put it like right here and we will sew um, these two pieces together, one on top of the other, just in a straight line right there. Okay, so after sewing, this is what it looks like, and then you can kind of open it up and squish it a little bit, and it will be a little flower for you, a little cactus. So here is my set of felt cacti that I will um, now put on a mobile to hang above my baby's crib. Um, I have seen people hand stitch them and put beads on them or put like X's um, and those are cute too so that's another idea for you. And to make the mobile um, I just got an embroidery hoop. This one is 10 inch one. I just got it at Hobby Lobby and um, I got some thin rope and a large um, needle. I called these doll needles 
and I just um, poked it through in the center of this cactus and tied a knot and um, then we'll hang these on the from the embroidery here. Okay, so I've put the um, all of the string or the thin rope onto each of the cacti and I just put them through the embroidery hoop um, and then tied them in a knot up at the top into like a little loop knot and I will hang it from a hook from the ceiling to have this little cactus mobile above the crib. So that's what it will look like when you have finished. Um, I've seen also some other people put like wooden beads or do sun um, felt um, things on it or hang some macrame things from it. So experiment and get creative and um, have fun making it.